Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Fast API. Today we are going to learn how to upload the images to the AWS S3 bucket. So those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. Let's get started. First of all, let me log in with the AWS console because I need some of the details. AWS console, let me log in with this. Login back. Okay, Rajni Khan, sign in. S3 bucket, so make sure you have to go with the S3 bucket. So currently I have already created the S3 bucket. So if you don't know how to create it, then you have to go with the uh, watch my previous videos like how to create the buckets so this is my bucket where I'm going to upload the images because according to it I have added the data so here we require the AWS bucket name here we require the region so let me go with the region I think this is the region that is this is the reason okay let's open it because here I found my reason Okay, so app not east one. Copy this and add it over here. Let's try to run this. Already it's run. Let's go to the uh, Swagger API. So here we have post upload. So let's try it out with the browse image. And let's clean this first. Whatever images we have, objects. Okay. So we have this one. So let's delete this and just type delete and delete objects. This is done. So only I think we have upload images, nothing over here, right? Let's try to upload this. Okay. So browse the image. So here we go with the current test API Python MongoDB. Okay. Let's try to execute this. And what will happen? This is the URL that we get into it. Let's check it is uploaded or not. So here you can see that it's uploaded. Okay. Here you can see that. Right. But SS denied because of that uh, security reasons. So we have to make it public. If I go just edit this permissions. Okay. And make it public. Read. Here we have the ACL object, everyone that can read, only read. Okay, I understand. Right, and save the changes. And once I just go with this one, upload image, and uh, you can see it's downloadable, right? And you can open the file, okay? So this is how you can do that. Let's dive into the code level. So first of all, make sure you have the Boto3 you have to import okay so if you have to install this one this for the aws sdk package so first one that is import from the fast api upload file and the file and those who are already watching my python video flask video and everything so they come to know about how to install that one okay so the, here we have the fast api initialization now we have the aws credentials and the s3 bucket information key id ss key region and the bucket so if you don't know how to get the ss key id secret everything i have already uploaded in my playlist so you can just watch how to get the ss key secret key aws you will get it okay next the main thing that is upload so here we have the function that is upload image we require the file upload file okay file we require connect to the aws s3 client so with the aws key and the secret and the region Okay, after that, we have to upload the image to the S3 bucket with the S3 underscore client upload file obj file S3 bucket name and the file name. Okay, generate the URL for the uploaded image. So this is that one and return that image URL. Okay, and except if something goes wrong, it will go with the exception. And if I go and check the URL which we receive in here, fast API, I think this is the same one, right? I think. We should, uh, we should like uh, make it the URL like the time based or something. We can also do that part. Okay. So this image 
I think because there is a spaces over here. Okay, so that's the reason because here the image is uploaded like this. Object URL is generating like this. Okay, this is the image that I get it, and this is object URL. I think we should return. Okay, with everything. Okay, so you can make that URL. Any doubt, any query in that? Do let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day, and don't forget to like, share, and comment on my video. Have a nice day.